Alright, so hopefully I got the right angle this time. It looks like it's so far, but oh, we'll see when I start riding. Anyways, I hit 50 mile an hour once. Thought I'd show you guys that in a video. But tonight, I wanted to do a pedal kit review. You get, uh, I forgot the name of the guy that asked for it, but one of you fine people commented asking for a review on the pedal kit. And uh, as you could tell by my legs not moving right now, I don't have the pedal kit installed. Now there's a simple reason for that. It's just that the bike is geared too low. <laughs> the pedals only get you, I wouldn't even say five miles an hour. <laughs> so I just don't use them. To me it's not worth the stability, the instability you get when you put the pedals on. Cause then that's one more balance point you have to worry about. And like one more little adjustment that you gotta watch while you ride. So to me, the pedals just aren't worth it at all. I originally got them due to like legalities and stuff, just in case like for whatever reason I get stopped and they're just like, hey, you can't have that on the street motorized vehicle. I'll be like, it's just pedal assisted. But even then, it's still not worth it to me to have the pedal kit on there. It's simply because then you just it's easy to watch your foot placement on the pegs, right? But on the pedals when they're moving, that's just a one way you could slip uh, even more than like you already can because the stock pegs are really grippy. <laughs> but the pedals, they're just they're just really cheap plastic construction. Like they have plastic cranks too, so like just just nothing about the pedals are really good. Like, if it didn't take so much time, and I might do this later, is take off the sprocket for the pedals, because they're just not worth it at all to me. <laughs> so, uh, like, I don't really have much to say about the pedal due to that reason. So, I'm just going to ride around a bit more and hope that this camera angle works out. I don't really have anything else to talk about, because I... I didn't really have too much planned <laughs> for for the pedal kit as it, it's just simply not something I would use. Now, like I said, someone did ask about them and I did tell this man I would upload a video about the pedals, but I already shot like a couple other videos, one of which being trail riding the Suron with the Fusion. Now the GoPro Fusion is just a pain to edit, so I've been trying to get that done all day. I was working on that cruiser's exhaust as you've seen in the last video and just cleaning my room and all, just a bunch of other things I needed to catch up on that I could finally catch up on now that we're under quarantine. So I just haven't got around to shooting this video, but today I have, so the guy that asked for it, <laughs> I'll be sure to one, at you in the video that you asked for this at so you'll know that it's up. And two, I'll pin your comment just because I forgot your name <laughs> and and I couldn't say anything in this video. So we'll see what these do. So yeah, I will pin you in the next video. <coughs> but uh, other than that, I got, all I could really say is the pedal's just no practical use. I, I'm just going to be really repetitive this whole time because I <laughs> I have nothing to say about them. I mean, you, you'd think like to, if you ran out of battery, because like full speed like this, or you're just matted on the throttle the whole time, you usually see about 20 miles. And I'm heading into the wind right now, so that's not really helping my battery life much either. But even if you die, I could tell you with 100% certainty, one, it'll be faster just to push the bike <laughs> instead of use the pedal kit. And two, you'd save energy doing that because it's geared so low, you're pedaling as hard as you can and you can't even keep up with someone walking. <laughs> so that's just really bad. I gotta pull over and adjust my helmet here. It came up a little bit. Okay, I'm safely adjusted now. I could come up. I have the mic at my chin bar again because that seemed to work last time but the last time I just wasn't really aimed up too good. So
so we'll we'll see maybe maybe the camera's aimed right this time the headlight on it is plenty enough for me to see at night what I want to do just because I know this is a really short view and video is I want to check out this one spot I was thinking about jumping so well, I'll just ride down there quickly scope it out see if I could do anything on it well, hopefully I have enough SD card storage for this video so far it looks like I'm good it is really windy and cold but I am layered up so I'm ready to take on the chills my hands are getting a little cold but uh, I'm almost to the spot I want to be That's another thing too is I actually haven't had any trouble with police or anything on here I mean I've, I've seen a couple officers uh, they've passed me like coming coming this way while I'm going this way they passed me uh, they didn't say anything I drove past them in lots I I haven't yet been next to an officer in traffic but the one time I was going through my buddy's neighborhood with him and uh, I'm not in a good position here a anyways there's three of them pulled off to the side and then another three of them were standing outside of their cars and this was like right at a stop sign <laughs> so like uh, they definitely saw me they definitely saw that I didn't have plates or anything and they just it just didn't really seem to care <laughs> I originally wanted my buddy out here so we could have more lighting and someone filming uh, from the outside of the bike to check out this spot I want to jump but he said it's too cold for him and that he didn't want to so it's all good hopefully I could get this added it up posted tonight because it's like what eight o'clock now okay so I'll pull off here this is a spot right here <laughs> now that I'm not going fast we'll pull up my visor a bit so I can see and this seems like a smooth spot this is what I wanted to jump here I don't think that'll be that bad I could practice over here on this side too so this is a spot I wanted to check out, just see what it's about. <laughs> that's, that's a weird shot. Yeah, that's a weird hill and dip over there, but... <laughs> There's a car over there, hopefully they don't mind what I'm doing here. Yeah, it kind of bottoms out at the top. Uh, it ain't smooth enough that I'm gonna try it alone so I'll just wait till my buddy gets out and we could record that well I think that's all for this video it's time for me to head home I'll cut the record when there's yeah, actually I could cut the record right now peace